This spell is for Gensman Ertz, someone I have reason to believe was once a secret agent operating out of Cold War Cuba. And when he retired, he stole the hat. Gentlemen, the word is gentlemen. It is spelled G-E-N-T-L-E-M-A-N. Gentlemen. I've never been big on gender roles or any other sort of fashion trend, really. Who can keep up? Pink is a feminine color now. Pink, the color of a bloody bandage or a battle scar. If you say so. But gentle man, you'd have to be mad to object to that. It goes without saying that men should be gentle if they're strong enough. And anyone moving a big screen TV up the steps will tell you it takes more strength to be gentle than rough. And life is a lot like moving furniture. Just ask Sisyphus. But ladies and gentlemen, what made ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, was always more about class than class acts. Noblemen were born of nobility, sons of royal parents, and gentlemen were born of the gentry, as in the landed gentry, the landlords, the owners. And just like the word noble came to mean all the things the nobility liked to think of itself, the word gentle came to mean all the things the gentry pretended to be. Civilized, superior, using the right manners, the right words, the right accent, the right fork, which proved they were right, right? Right because they followed the rules they'd made up better than anyone else ever could. Right to hold themselves higher because of it. Right to drive the commoners off the commons by lash and sword, badge and gun. Right to drive ruffians, ill-mannered rabble like you and me into debt and servitude. Right? It seems to me nothing has ever been further from gentleness as we know it today than a gentleman as they acted back then at the start. I can only hope with the new sense of the word gentle will come a new sort of gentleman. One with the kind of gentility that can move a TV up the stairs, protecting the fragile, controlling only themselves. Until then, don't bother to call me a gentleman. Just keep calling me what most people do. Can you guess? Give me the words. I spell them.